Hello, 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 hello. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for all my beautiful and my handsome Leos out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Um, keep in mind that this is a generating, so it's not going to resonate with every Leo out there. So please, you know, take the parts that does and what doesn't. Leave it on out. Also, this could be the past, present, or in the future. And to be aware of any scammers in the comment section pretending to be me. Leo. There seems as if there was a situation that you got away from, okay? You are someone that made it out of something, or some type of circumstances. Maybe that was property. Maybe that was a crazy-ass abusive relationship. I don't even say abusive, but, you know, just a toxic-ass relationship that you had to let go of. Whatever it was, okay? Some of you also, it was a point in time, maybe even now, you guys were on a budget. You had to basically, you know, um, save your money, spend your money wisely is what I'm getting. But it's something that you pray for, okay? Something that you pray for, all right? Um, in the past here, something that you pray for in the past. And it's like whatever that is, is coming towards you now here is what I'm getting, Leo. Some of you, it's like you got away from something. Maybe you had kids by an individual and you moved away with you and your children. And it was like it was kind of a struggle. That's why you had to be on a budget or what have you. But something that you pray for in the past is now coming back around is what I'm getting. Or it's about to come around. But it's something that you actually want here, Leo. Okay? Um... You were being protected by someone that was very prideful. Someone here that was trying to distract you. Because it's like, I'm getting like, you got away. You got away and you ended up making something of yourself. You ended up becoming successful in some type of way or whatever it is. Whoever this individual is, they were so fucking prideful. It could be a Taurus because we do have Taurus here. Okay. They're going to be a Taurus here that was trying to distract you here. They was trying to betray you in some type of way or stab you in your back. All right. Um, this is what I'm getting. And it has to do with, for some of y'all, it has to do with your work. Maybe your, whatever you do for work, you very, com you know, compassionate about your work. You love the, what you do here. It's not even considered work for some of y'all, not all of y'all, but whatever you do is like for some of y'all, you could love doing what you do. You could be very skilled at something. Okay. Um, I'm getting something like a, a fashion design or something of the nature, for example, okay? But you're, you love to do this. This is your justice, okay? This is what, you know, got you to where you are right now. But somebody wanted you to have some type of a tower moment. Somebody here wanted to, it's like you were being protected from something this whole entire time. Because you did the work and you chose to get away from whatever this was, is what I'm getting, okay? Um, here's the thing, though. There is someone here that is grieving, and I'm getting not just one person, but two people. There's a masculine here. This could be an air sign in Aquarius, Gemini, Libra here, all right, that wanted to move forward with you, but they see that you have a, some type of a new lover here is what I'm getting, Leo, or you're about to have a new lover, something of that nature. But this person sees that you are a very family-oriented person. Okay, very family oriented. It's like you are, you are an empress or you are an emperor. It's like you're very, you could be traditional, but it's like you, you are a big sign. So you could like to do things on a strict schedule. Okay, you wear, so for example, you wake up. Okay, you get your day started, get your kids ready and up for school. Okay, but you know, and you go to work or whatever it is that you do. But it's like you're very, very traditional, very organized individual. And you got this King of Swords looking at you as somebody that's very family oriented. Okay, this person is currently grieving over you right now. Okay, because some of you could be moving forward, maybe with a cancer, don't have to be. I'm getting Capricorn energy as, as well, or you can have that in your chart. Um, but there is a feminine energy that's very mad right now. Okay, at this King of Swords and at you because they see how this King of Swords adores you. Okay, somebody knows that somebody has some type of secret feelings for you. It's like you are someone that can tame and lock down this individual. Okay, this this other feminine energy, she knows that she could not get this person on lock. Okay, and you're not even around this person. You moved away from this person. And this, this feminine is jealous of that because they're still around this masculine energy. And they're not able to tame them, make them faithful, change them in no type of way. First of all, you can't change nobody because if they want to change, they'll change. Okay, some men do change when they come across that, you know, that, that one, that one, okay? 
and they're looking at you like that. Whoever this masculine energy is looking at you as the one. Okay, and this feminine energy knows that for some particular reason. Maybe like, ooh, four, four, four on the clock. Maybe, like I said, some of you have children by this individual, what have you. All right, or you feel it in some type of way. But this feminine energy is very pissed off because she knows for a fact that um, she cannot change this masculine. We got the devil card. This masculine is obsessed with you. She knows that he has some type of obsession with you, which caused her to have an obsession with you because... You know how people be sitting down and they be pillow talking or whatever like that. These two cut a pillow talk. That's probably how they even got together. Or this feminine energy knew about you. Okay. Matter of fact, this could have, for some of y'all, this could have been a third party situation. that knew you was with this masculine energy. And um, she was jealous. So she tried to take this masculine from you. But in actuality, she never talked to, you know, took shit from you. Okay. She just lightened up your load, if you know what I'm saying. Like, uh you let the bitch have the nigga, okay? Because at the end of the day, anybody is going to cheat, especially on the Leo. Because Leo like a lot of attention from their person. And if they feel like their person is cheating out here in the streets, they're going to leave them behind, okay? Because the Leo is the one and only, okay? The main. I mean, not even the main. Because if you're a main, that means you got other little side pieces and chicks and shit like that. You got a list, okay? Because if the Leo ain't the one and only, then they don't want you at all. They're going to give them to the scallywags, okay? They're going to give them to the scallywags. All right, but this masculine is obsessed with you because of something that you do. Like I said, you made it out. I'm getting you made it out of the circus. Okay, these clowns wanted you to join to join the circus, but you're not joining the circus. Okay, with these clowns. All right, why would you entertain any clowns here? You will, you're going to become a clown. So you you have too many standards for that. Okay, you have high standards. I should say. All right, but who? But some of y'all, this feminine energy is definitely a Virgo. I'm definitely getting a Virgo because we got Virgo right here. Virgo, okay, or Taurus. We got Taurus up here as well, and Capricorn with the Devil card. So it definitely could be an uh, Earth sign here that is facing some type of judgment at this time. Um, whoever this feminine energy is, okay, because she conspired against you with maybe an Aquarius, or maybe somebody just cannot stand the fact that you are a star. Okay, definitely it's Taurus here. Okay, an Aquarius energy. Somebody can ask. You could be a spiritual teacher, spiritual worker, um, spiritual guru, whatever you want to call it. Okay, um, you just could be a speaker, public speaker, something in the nature. You just in a public eye, and this person was so jealous of that, so they was conspiring against you. It's to the point where this feminine energy. It's like you ain't even worried about this hoe though. It's so crazy because you could know this, but you're not even worried about this bitch. Okay, this this female is mad because we have your unrequited love. To be honest with you, I'm really getting that. Whoever, this is crazy, y'all. But I'm definitely getting this feminine energy. Could be uh, they could like women. Okay, they could like women. All right, as well. I'm definitely getting that lesbian vibes from this this uh, Keegan Virgo, whoever this Virgo is. Okay. We got here physically attracted. This person thinks that you're very physically attracted. And I'm all, I'm also getting that this masculine, this king of swords here, does not find this person physically attractive anymore. We have unrequited love and physically attracted. So this masculine is not physically attracted to this feminine energy anymore. Yeah, we got here not interested. Damn. So which has caused this feminine energy to become obsessed with this masculine and you. And it's crazy. That's why I said I don't fuck with bums or nothing like that because... For example, um, what, everybody know that popular case that happened back in the day. I don't know if I mentioned this before, but how this woman was killed and gunned down. I don't know if she was pregnant or not, but she was killed and gunned down by her husband's mistress. She had no fucking clue about a mistress. You feel what I'm saying? And the fact that she she got unalive due to a masculine energy. Okay, to her husband, she had no no clue about this feminine energy. That that bitch should have directed that energy towards that masculine, not this feminine energy, because she has nothing to do with this situation. Okay, but this is how this is what was going on. Okay, all because yeah, this 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 feminine energy has become obsessed with you because this masculine energy is no longer attracted to her anymore. She knows that he's attracted to you and he's obsessed with you. Oh. So that's why this person was trying to, that's why she's getting judged at this time because not only was she trying to throw something at you due to a masculine, but she was trying to distract you from your work because maybe she felt like if you are a teacher of some sort, she could have felt like you were telling the truth, okay? Or the truth was coming out in some type of readings or something. Yeah. Oh, I'm telling you, it's the four coins and the ace of staffs. Somebody here is not attracted to the feminine any, anymore. So she want to blame you. She want to blame you because this mask is not attracted to her anymore. But that, that's not your problem, okay? The fuck, bitch, you need to be mad at him and find somebody else that's going to love your raggedy ass, okay? Come on. Yeah, she was trying to stagnate you, trying to put you down. 
Trying to affect your finances. Trying to put your ass on the budget. Okay? It's what I'm getting. She, she didn't want you to see something here. Yeah, because she was highly jealous of you. Highly jealous of you and competing with you. About some type of family. Maybe she wanted a family with this, this masculine energy. But this masculine energy wanted a family with you. Like I said, some of you could have moved away from this person. You could have had kids by this individual. And you moved away from him. Okay? You moved away from his ass. Because he was a cheater. He was, he was you know what I'm saying? He, was, he probably got sex addictions or something like that with this devil card being here. All right? And he got this this earth sign caught up in his web. But you are the one. That's what I said. You are the one that got away. But he got this earth sign here caught up in his, in his web. Okay? But she can't get mad at you? The fuck? Yeah. You still about to get this new opportunity. Whatever it is. Okay, here, Leo. All right? You're not going to be on a fucking budget. You're going to be in the king of pentacles motherfucking status. Okay? Period. Ain't no budget over here, boo-boo. Wow, that's sad. That's sad. We got also got here the King of Cups. Okay, who's this King of Cups? We got the Wheel of Fortune. Who's this King of Cups? Oh, six of staff. What is this? There could be oh, there's yeah, you could have a secret admirer, or there's a king of cups here that's watching you that wants to express some type of love towards you. Like I said, some of you could be in the public eye here, but this king of cups is, is overwhelmed and stressed out by the attention that you're receiving from others. They kind of be it's like this this king of cups is not like insecure or anything of that nature, but they do get intimidated by all the attention that you're receiving, okay? For some of y'all, you're dealing with uh you dealing with a whole nother situation. You ain't even dealing with this King of Swords. The fuck? All right? Oh, well, I'm telling you, there's somebody that wants to give you something. This King of Cups energy. All right? Yeah. You could be giving it to this person. Okay, then we have a King of Staff. Who's this King of Staff? Yeah, somebody is very attracted to you. Okay? Somebody definitely is very... Oh, King of Swords. Coming out again in a different day. This King of Swords with the Five of uh, Swords is a liar. Okay, they only want to come towards you because of what you have. Okay, because of your attention and recognition. So this person is a user. This King of this King of Swords is a user, but this King of Cups could be like um, the person that wants to be with you, that's watching, that's spying on you. That could be like some type of a secret admirer. Okay, so Leo, you better put a word face. What's the outcome? Yeah, the outcome is somebody going to be in some type of grief, okay? In some type of sorrow, baby. On their knees crying about you here, Leo. Yeah, there's a queen of cups here. A mother figure that is definitely doing some type of self-reflection about this toxic energy that they decided to play in, okay? Yeah. Ooh, yup. Yup. Something is coming in quickly for this queen of cups. This could also be a baby mother, Okay. We got the nine of stats. Something is being blocked. This person is being blocked out. This feminine energy, like I said, they already facing some type of a judgment. This person is going to end up single or this king of swords is going to end up single, okay? That's what I'm getting. While you're going to be in this ten, ten of pentacles energy, ooh, with this ace of coins, uh, excuse me, ace of cups, You've been manifesting this. So for some of y'all, you about to be in some type of a family-oriented situation. These people here wanted to be with you. Yeah, I said these people wanted to be with you. This this earth sign and this king of swords. But you're about to be in some type of relationship maybe with the king of cups here. Okay, this is what I'm getting. Yeah, Virgo, hermit, magician. Yeah, this person was definitely trying to throw some magic at you. Trying to keep you stuck. Pisces energy. Okay, sun card. But you're about to be very happy. Very fucking happy. And this group is getting exposed. All right, and I'm gonna end it right there, especially over this blue moon tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I'm gonna end it right there. I love you guys so freaking much. I need anything else from me? Look in the description box below. Love you guys. See you next time. Bye.